بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين الصلاة والسلام على خير خلقه سيدنا ومولانا محمد وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين أما بعد um, okay so um, let's go to uh, uh, the I think first is Al Mulkiyaf isn't it okay uh, again just uh, before we we'll start I want to give you uh, the main reference um, to this um, uh, subject. So we do have two types of references for this. The first is the Greek references. Okay, so it is the Greek philosophers, and the most famous one is um, he, his name used to be. Uh, uh, we call him in Arabic Batalamus. Batalamus. I don't know in uh, English. He should have some something different. Uh, maybe Batalamus or something. Yes. So his name is Batalamus, and in the. Uh, 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 amongst the uh, Arabian authors, the most famous uh, author is Fakhruddin Razi. And you know him, everyone knows him. Uh, Shafi'i Ashari scholar. As well as um, uh, Abdullah al-Ansari al-Antaki. Okay, so I use the second author as my main reference. <coughs> okay, so now... <coughs> um, uh, as you know, for example, in English scientific, uh, uh, in English science or the contemporary science, we do classify, for example, uh, all of the tiger and all of the, uh, uh, j jaguar and leopard. All of them we classify them as cats. Am I right? Different cats. But in the um, uh, in the uh, in our knowledge in here, we do not classify them as the same. Okay. For example, we say that um, uh, tiger and lion, both of them are cats, but they do have two different characters. Okay, so we say um, uh, zoologically, biologically, they are from the same family, but in terms of character, it's not necessarily the same. Okay, so that's why um, we have spoken about the tiger and jaguar and all of them, the last lecture, now about the cat. About the cat. Do I have any cats today here? <laughs> okay, so if we have one, okay, actually we have one, yeah. Um, uh, just uh, look at yourself, what you are. It is social person, okay, social, but cheating, okay. So you may not see the real face. Whatever he says may not be correct as well as very proud okay it is the person very proud and normally the cat person will be very handsome okay so it could be the one of the uh, best looking ladies as well as the the, the most uh, handsome gentleman okay yeah and uh, so that's what it may make them to be proud Okay, as well as it is the person who likes Porsche style of life. Okay, so uh, if it will be two options, one is to struggle, and the second is to uh, have a comfortable life just by cheating and lying, he doesn't mind to go to the second one. And also, it is the person, do you know, who have three type of personalities. One is feminine and one is masculine. And the third one is in between. Hemophrodite. Okay, so the cat is hemophrodite. Yes. So for example, do you know the man's character? Man's character, he says, I will do it, he will do. It, we, we call it as masculine character. And it, it's not necessarily with the men. It could be with the ladies also. Okay? And feminine character is like, uh, okay, so when I, when I will have a chance, I will do. Okay? So that is uh, feminine. It could be men, but he's feminine man. Okay? But what about the hemophrodite? He will say, yes, 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 but then he will never do it. Okay? We call him hemophrodite. Okay, so the cat man is him of that personality. And also, he lies. Okay, he lies. And sometimes um, may lie openly also, doesn't mind. Okay, so the feeling of others, not that important as his own comfort. 
And also, it is a person who will be attached to the place rather than to the person. For example, let's suppose that um, I'm working, I'm Catman, and I'm working in the office, in the company. Okay, and I have my friends there. And one of my friends, best friends who supported me, is being released from the work. And he is saying to me, okay, let's go with me, you know, we'll find something else. I will stay in my office and I will say, bye-bye, see you next, you know. So that is the catman, okay, doesn't care about the people, okay. So he will enjoy the place and position more than the people. Do you understand what I mean? So, for example, um, a masculine man will be engaged with the man more than with the position or the wealth or etc., you know. So, he will be happy with the friends in the poverty than being, for example, in the wealthy status, but with no man, with no friends. But cat is totally different. Okay, so now, do you have any friends like that? Anyone? Uh, cats are actually uh, uh, very widespread animals, you know? The most um, wide, widespread animals are, uh, do you know that um, uh, uh, rats and mice and that category? And the second biggest uh, widespread animals are cats, including the real cat and the other types of cats. Yeah. <coughs> uh, I mean, all together. Okay, so then um, the next one is, uh, the next animal is, <coughs> I'm sorry. Um, the next animal is, um, uh, do you know that uh, uh, Jarbo, Jarbo, what do they call it? Jarbo, okay. Do I have any? So how to distinguish? It's normally person uh, will have, um, uh, when you just look at his face, straight away you can see his ears, you know? Do you understand? There are that type of people, okay? Straight away you will see the... Uh, <coughs> Um, the ears, as well as uh, the legs will be slimmer than the body. Legs will be slimmer than the body, as well as the hands will be weaker, weaker than the body. Okay, so that is the, the main character of the jarbo. <clears throat> um, normally, it is a uh, filthy people, uh, a filthy people. Um, uh, in, uh, and also, why? Because uh, j just keep it in your mind. Whenever, so you, your personality and your body are one whole. Uh, does that make sense? Whenever one will be less, the second will be bigger. Just to uh, back up. Means, for example, you are very weak. Means you will be very, you can say, evil uh, uh, evil, you can say, a thinking person. Uh, why? Because you are weak. So you cannot win your partner with the strength. So you will, you, uh, win, the, uh, you, you will win the partner with intelligence. Does make sense? Okay. But as stronger is the person, so that less he will have the uh, evil. Okay. But it's, it's again not all the time. Okay. For example, let's say tiger. Okay, tiger. We said it is evil as well as it's a strong man. Okay, but then because of its strong body, definitely something else will be less. Uh, okay, so for example, in some cases, in some cases, uh, because um, <clears throat> for example, it is very strong, so self confidence is there. Okay, so that's why uh, it may not be very generous. Why? Because generosity sometimes it will be your character, but sometimes it will be your. Um, uh, uh, tactic to win. Why? Because you will imagine yourself in the weak situation and if you will be generous now, you will get it back afterward. So it's not a natural thing. But it is some, you can say, uh, um, thing that you are preparing for yourself. Okay? Uh, and also, um, and also it is the person of very weak uh, character. 
Okay, there is no, uh, um, uh, when you are making some business, pr uh, business project, definitely you have to avoid that type of people. Okay, they never trust themselves and they are more about, you can say, um, uh, uh, with the strong people, they will be with the strong people and they will be having the leftover food. But by themselves, they are unable to do anything. And also, <coughs> he says, uh, in terms of its evil, it's very big amount of evil in it. And now, the next animal is, uh, do you know that lizard, big lizard? Big lizard. You know, uh, it's um, actually not difficult to uh, read the face of the uh, lizard. Okay, please can you give me how it will look like? Big eyes. Big eyes. Is it necessary? It's not necessary, no. Most of the time... Long body. Excellent. That's the main, main uh, uh, distinguishing thing from the rest of the animals. Both of crocodiles as well as the lizards, they will have longer body than the hands and legs. Okay, so there are people, just by looking, you will say, okay, uh, it's, uh, the legs, hands, and the body are not balanced. Okay, so it, it could be either uh, it will be crocodile or either it will be lizard, some type of lizard. <coughs> so then he says, <coughs> it has very big portion of patience. So sober is there. It can bear any type of problems, but in the same time, it is a tell-bearing personality. Okay, so if you have that type of friend, then you have to make sure that in very short period, you are going to lose all of your friends. Why? Because this person is going to make a lot of slander of you. Will make up stories that you said about some certain people. And very soon you are going to stay on your own with no friends. Okay, and Also, it is the person of the greatest cheating personality. Okay, so all um, most the most important thing in this life is his own benefit. Okay, and even when you find him helping you, so you have to try to understand that he is looking for his own benefit from you, or after your some uh, 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 maybe strength or wealth or etc. And in the same time, it is an animal with uh, no you can say certainty, very changing personality. Okay, so uh, <clears throat> for example, you may find him, yesterday he was thinking of setting up a um, food business. And today he will be thinking of uh, maybe buying house to rent. And the next day he will have something different. So there is no certainty, you know, Doesn't, there is no solidity. Okay. And now, please, can we go to the next type of animals? It is the animals with the hoof. Yes. We didn't we? Okay, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. What other animals that we did, please? Okay. Is it okay? Is it okay if? Today, inshallah, we'll complete all of the uh, hoof animals, okay, and uh, all of them without missing any. And the next week, we'll briefly go through these two types, okay, the, the, the uh, rat type as well as the predator animals, just very briefly, okay. And l l let's finish the hoof. What, what do they call? Is it hoof? The, the leg at the end of the leg. Do you know, for example, a uh, cow has, uh, or the donkey's hoof. Hoof, isn't it? Yeah, so we are, we are, uh, now we're talking about that type of animals. And the first one is the elephant. Okay, so what is the, the uh, most, you can say, um, uh, biggest sign that you can distinguish the elephant from the rest of the animals? First of all, that is one thing. And the second is? Nose, okay, it's a good thing, yeah. Of course, yeah, it is. Okay, big body. And also, it doesn't have to be fat. 
even lion could be fat, but he's not big. Do you understand? So it is exactly as you said, big body, not fat body. It could be fat or not fat, but big body, large body. Okay. Okay, so that is the elephant. First of all, it is one of the most strongest personalities. Okay, as well as it is um, uh, very, um, uh, very brave. And also, it is uh, the personality with, uh, uh, you can say, high level of uh, enthusiasm. Okay, what do they call that type of personalities? Enthusiastic, maybe. Yeah, so it is that type of personality. So when it uh, grabs something, definitely it will just cut it off. It's easier for the elephant to cut off that thing than to die. Why? Because if it's concerned about something, definitely it will do it. Okay, so it is, I would, I would say, I would say, if there will be two personalities, two personalities, lion leading, lion leading, and elephant doing, performing, I say that is the best ever company. Okay. Or e even a goat is good also, in terms of leading with elephant doing. Okay. Uh, and also, uh, it is the personality of, you can say, um, uh, do you know the people of jokes? Kind. Kind personality. Uh, kind? Humor. Humor. Yeah, yeah. So making a lot of uh, uh, jokes, etc. And normally, um, for example, when I make joke, okay, you find it n not all the time suitable to my face, you know? Uh, do you understand what I mean? But when elephant makes uh, fun, even in normal condition, he may make everyone to laugh, but he will stay normal, you know? Uh, do you understand what I mean? So it is his character. Okay. But one thing about, uh, he has, the elephant has a um, dark corner in the heart. Be aware of that. Okay. He may serve you for a long time, but when it will be time, he may just step on you and then carry on, you know. Okay. So normally when you are dealing with the people of, a uh, people with dark corner in your heart, all the time you have to carry on uh, rewarding them. Uh, do you understand what I mean? Because if that dark corner of the heart will be activated, then you can do nothing to stop it. So make sure that that will stay passive. Carry on rewarding them, you know? Carry Sometimes only just beautiful word could be reward. Okay? And if you are eating something, make sure that he eats with you. He's not he's watching and you are eating, you know? And if you bought something, make sure that you will give him small gift. Just to keep that dark corner uh, passive, not active. Okay. Um, <clears throat> you know, just uh, for your information, 99% of the animals are evil. So that's what people are. Okay. The 99% of uh, people are evil. Okay. So only one portion, one out of a hundred, are the people naturally good. I'm not talking the person um, of strength. But it's a different thing, am I right? Person could be very strong, but he could be good. Okay, so I'm talking about evil and good. So 99% of the people are evil. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَلَوْ أَعْجَبَكَ كَثْرَةُ الْخَبِيثِ means, O oh Prophet, we are going to combine all of the evil natures to throw them into the hell and you will be amazed by the quantity of the evil. Okay, now even for example in that hadith what um, uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala orders Adam alayhi salam, he says separate the people of paradise from the people of hell. And then Adam alayhi salam says how to do it? So Allah says one out of thousand are going to paradise. Means it's not 99% but 999% are evil and only 1% are good. Uh, do you understand? Yeah. So because so far the animals, the character of the animals that we are reading, all of them are negative, negative, negative. You may ask why? Because I say because that's what majority of the people are. Okay. But then, we do not find that much evil. You, you know, I say, you are too, um, I say, uh, uh, out of the 
of the uh, problems. But when you will get engaged with the people, then when you realize that majority of the people are evil. Okay, so many evil uh, things. Okay, so then, it is, uh, uh, elephant is the, uh, I would say, man of, it's very into the sexual things, actually. So it, it doesn't matter, men or women, both of them are very into this. Okay, so uh, wh whenever they will have a chance, they do not release it, they do not let it go. Okay, but what about uh, religion saying no, etc.? Well, um, uh, religion may not stop them all the time. Or most of the time, religion will not stop them. Whenever they will have a chance, they will go for it. Now, the next is buffalo. How to distinguish the buffalo from others? Yes, please. No, <laughs> face, face is not round, but it's just long, you know, long from here. Okay, uh, uh, I don't know. It's, it look, I don't know, Allah alam. As well as it has, uh, I mean, the, uh, the, the person will have small head. Do you understand what I mean by small head? Yes, exactly. So not small face, but head is small. Do you understand? So for example, um, ca can you look aside? This is big head. <laughs> you also look aside. Yes, that is big head. So the, do you know the distance from the ear to the head is very small. Small head. Does make sense? <laughs> We don't have any buffalo today here. <laughs> Actually, one is sitting here. Um, so first of all, it is um, uh, very intelligent. Okay, it could be professor, it could be doctor, it could be herbalist also. Um, also, it is um, the the most uh, uh, you can say notable thing in the character is very jealous. Okay, so for example, let's suppose that your wife is like that. Make sure that you do not uh, receive a text message even from your colleagues. Yes. Shaykh said that buffalo is intelligent. Yeah, yeah. But we consider buffalo as not being very intelligent. No, uh, normally because do you know the uh, English thing and it doesn't match all the time. Do you understand what I mean? Yeah. For example, um, when we say snake, snake. In the English understanding, it is the evil man, am I right? But Chinese say it is the most intelligent. Uh, do you understand what I mean? So each of them have their own uh, signs, actually. Uh, do you understand? Or for example, all. All. In uh, Arabian, in here, all is the sign of bad, evil. Okay? But what about the, uh, what about the uh, Western thing? Wisdom. Wisdom. Uh, do you understand? Okay, so that's why they do have different way of reading the face. Um, do you understand what I mean? Yes, it's, it's like that. Sorry? In India, as well, earlier, as an insult, they call someone like Uluka Patal, which means a child of an owl. That's the thing. Okay, okay, yeah. So, so yeah. An an animals in different cultures mean different things. Okay, but then if you want to uh, uh, read them. Um, uh, face according to the, for example, if you want to say that all is wisdom, then you have to get the um, uh, Western sign feature. Uh, do you understand? Uh, but if you will take all as uh, evil, then you have to get the features according to the Arabians. Um, that doesn't make sense. Yes, so it is like that. And then, um, uh, so, so it is very jealous person. Jealousy is maybe number one, maybe. Uh, so, um, uh, uh, let, let's suppose that you are married uh, to um, a buffalo lady. Okay, so then, in terms of implementing the sunnah of Rasulullah, forget about that. Okay, so for the sunnah of Rasulullah, you had to marry the sheep lady. Okay, or one of the types of the birds. Okay, or you being lion could marry a lioness, then you could implement the sunnah. 
But you are married to Buffalo lady? No. Forget about the Sunnah. Say, Ya Rasulullah, please forgive me. I'm not implementing your Sunnah. I'm unable. I don't want to die. Please. Okay? <laughs> yeah, so, um, you know, um, most of the ladies are jealous. They think that they are unable to bear. But uh, some of them can bear it, you know. If you, if you will have second and third wife, some of them can bear it. But because it's like a public thing, Med, do you know that the media and TV created that thing, you know? So all of the ladies will think that I'm unable. But when they fall into that uh, situation, then character will come out. So if it is buffalo lady, definitely it's not going to go well. But if it is sheep lady, then she may bear it, you know? She may just say, okay, let, let it go then. Okay. And also, uh, it is a person of, uh, you can say, um, do you know the people who never forgive you? Uh, you do wrong to them, okay, and then they will just keep it for a long time. Uh, oh, sorry? Grudge. Grudge, yeah, yeah. So like, uh, like a camel. Okay, so uh, for example, normally you insult me for a couple of times, well, it's just gone, you know. But with them, it's never gone. They will keep it in their mind all the time. Uh, and also, uh, another thing, uh, it is the person who uh, is not very sociable uh, with the strangers. Cannot get uh, with the strangers very well. Okay. Next is, um, next is um, a cow. Uh, there will not be big difference between cow and buffalo in terms of how they look like. But then... Uh, uh, there could be uh, two, three main differences. What do you think uh, it could be? So, you, you yes. No, 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 no. I'm talking about the features. The main thing is ears. Yes. So, with the buffalo, normally it will be big and longer ears. Okay, but with cow, it's not all the time like that. Okay, but in terms of having a, a long face, both have. Okay, but then a buffalo will have triangle long face, you know. Uh, do you understand? So, for example, today, do I have... Um, uh, please, uh, what's your name? Yeah. Uh, look at me. No, no. Uh, So triangle face is like like him. Triangle face is like no no no. I'm not not, not talking. I'm talking about about him. So my face is also triangle, but not long. Do you understand? My face is also triangle, but not not long also. Okay. But uh, with the buffalo, it will be long as well as triangle. But what about the uh, cow? It will be long, but not triangle. But it will be. Uh, um, s square, square. Do you know the long one? Yeah, rectangle. Yes. Uh, with cow, n not all the time. But with uh, buffalo, is uh, is hundred uh, percent. Yeah. So that's how you can just distinguish. But in terms of the uh, the uh, how uh, hands and legs and body balance, it's it's the same. Uh, both of them are same. <coughs> and then with the. Uh, <coughs> Um, uh, with the cow, it's very sociable. Okay, so even with the strangers, doesn't mind. It's okay. And also, it is. Uh, it again has very uh, strong patience. Okay, a lot of sober. But um, uh, it's uh, normally the personalities. Uh, do you know the sad personalities? Do you understand what I mean? Sad personalities. For example. Um, if it chooses the uh, music, it will choose the most sad uh, music. And whenever it chooses the clothes, it will choose the most sad and colors. For example, black, brown. Okay, so the bright colors, for example, yellow, and that is not there. Okay, and also, um, if there are two options, either it's like a lights on and off, he will prefer the off. Sad personality, you know. It's not because of the uh, problems that he had in the past, but it is just uh, characters like that. Um, and also, it's also into the uh, sexual problems. Okay, so it is uh, the personality with 
uh, with that thing. And also, it is brave, courage. So courage with both of them. <coughs> and uh, normally, it is the personalities with... Um, uh, uh, how to explain it? Um, do you know, it's not, it's not the personality to whom you should give a flower in the birthday, but you should give maybe chocolates. Uh, do you understand what I mean? It's not like um, a philosophic, uh, spiritual uh, person, but it's more about like uh, uh, material, money. You, you, do you understand? Yeah. So even if you will give, um, give him a flower, it will eat the flower. Okay. So uh, that's the that's, uh, thing. And the next animal is a camel. First of all, is, it is... Uh, an animal, uh, uh, okay, how to distinguish? Long, long, okay, a long, but then, uh, do you know the giraffe also will have that thing? Okay, so it's very difficult to distinguish. Well, okay. Yes, correct, yes. Both of the legs and hands are long. Okay, but when it's with the giraffe, uh, it's, it's not all the time like that. Yes, correct. Legs, in comparison to the hands with the giraffe, it will be shorter. Legs will be shorter. But with the camel, both of them are long. And long neck. Okay. Normally, long neck will be the sign of, uh, you can say, uh, low intelligence. Long neck, okay? But with the women, long neck is, um, you can say, uh, <coughs> is the sound of a bit caprices, you know? Uh, do you know the women with the caprice, uh, caprices? You buy a golden ring, they will say, I, I never asked golden ring, I was asking for the earring. You will buy earring, they will say, I was asking for the ring. You buy a ring, they ask, no, I, I said the bracelet. Do you know the caprices? Yeah. Okay, anyway, so it is a uh, camel. The most, uh, most, you can say, visible thing in the camel, he, in terms of forgiving the people, is zero. Zero or even under zero. Never forgives. Okay? Even if you reward, no, 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 he has to take revenge. Okay? Uh, and also, another thing, is the people of the uh, mountains of passions. Very sabur, you know? Okay, so, uh, and also another thing, in terms of uh, knowledge, it is the last people. Knowledge is not their food. Okay. <clears throat> uh, and also, it is the, uh, when they are generous, they are generous to the level of West, you know, Westing. Okay, what do they call that type of people? They cannot keep things at all. They just give away, you know. So it is the same as, for example, you have a friend who will just give away everything for you, but if you insult him once, definitely he will take revenge on very, very bad manner. Okay? In the place in which you feel the weakest, he will take revenge then. Okay? So it is the personality with whom you should be very careful. And then a giraffe. Giraffe. So we did describe. So it's the person with long neck, and most of the time they will have small head in comparison to the body. Okay, so maybe uh, when you bring him to me, so maybe his head will be bigger than mine, but when you compare his own head to his body, you say it is small head. Okay, with long neck. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Uh, it is uh, actually the person, uh, I would say, light personality. Okay, light personality. So it's not like a cow, heavy personality, but light personality. So for example, with the, with the cow, when you are annoyed from the cow, you will just say, get lost from here, he will just stay there, you know. But with the giraffe, if you are annoyed, it will just live by itself. You know, so light personality. And also, uh, it's again the same problem, ignorance. Okay, I don't know. I don't know. Normally, normally, as I said, do you know the people with long, um, uh, long neck? It's widely accepted that 
their intelligence is not the highest one. Okay, so according to that, their knowledge will not be the best also. Okay, so they are the worst ever in terms of the knowledge. And also, it is the person uh, who likes to spend waste time in playing and enjoyments and entertaining. It's the person who can just uh, switch on um, uh, TV and spend whole day and whole night also. Okay, but th there are some issues that he has to do. Well, never mind. Let's carry on watching. Okay, uh, as well as it's the person of uh, it's very um, uh, uh, you can say. Um, uh, Proud person. Uh, uh, how to say? Um, uh, it's not the person. Uh, do, do you know the pride? Yes, they evaluate. The, they over evaluate themselves all the time. Okay. Sorry. Yeah, exactly. For example, let's say that uh, I have ten thousand pounds, but I will say I have a couple of millions. Okay. Uh, or, for example, I will say, let's suppose that um, I have three wives. Do you know that, you know? But I don't have even one. You know? It's that type of thing, making up uh, stories, you know? I think most of the people, they go through that period in their life, am I right? Okay, so I remember when um, there used to be, um, do you know when uh, mobile phones came first? Okay, in that time I was in Syria. I, I used to have some, some friends, actually, they would be holding the broken and damaged mobile phones, you know, out of just showing off, you know, time to time just holding it. Do you understand what I mean? Yeah, so, but, but with giraffe, it's just nature. All the time is there. Okay. <clears throat> and also, uh, the, the, next, uh, the next animal is, um, uh, do you know the animal which is wild cow? We call it uh, new, I think. N new cow, new cow. Yeah, it is called new. Do, do you know? Normally, it, it lives in savannas, and normally, a lion hunts some certain type of uh, uh, cow. It, it, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So it is new. New. They call. It is brown. Yes. Yeah, 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 correct, yeah, yeah. Wildebeest. What do they call it? Wildebeest. Wildebeest. Okay, so that's what we're talking about. Okay, so first of all, it is a person of, you can say, no morals. There is no any morals. No behaving, no morals. No religion, no nothing. As well as, it is the person who n is not uh, accessible. You cannot get an access, you know. Do you know, uh, what do they call it? Reachable, easily reach. what do they call it? So, yeah, exactly. So you cannot get through to them, you know. You cannot set up some friendship. Okay, wild people. As well as, they make fun a lot. They make fun of the people a lot. Okay, so uh, you are sitting and you are his friend, you know. But he may just, um, uh, you can say, uh, insult you by making up um, fun out of you, you know, about, about you. As well as, it is the person with... Uh, it's a very greedy person with ignorance. Okay, so it is a person with no brain, actually. And it is very greedy, but very, very brave. Very brave personality. Okay, so next is the wild sheep. The wild sheep. Not domestic, but wild. How to, how to know them? How to distinguish them? Normally, it is uh, very hairy people. Okay. So, uh, but then you have to be very smart because most of the Asians are hairy. So then you have to work it out according to that uh, standard. Do you, do you know what I mean? So, for example, Chinese people... They don't have any. But as you know, two animals are very hairy. One is a uh, lion and one is a um, wild sheep. Okay, so even according to the uh, Chinese, they do call some certain level people, according to them, hairy. Uh, do you understand what I mean? Yeah. So, but then what about Asians? Most of the Asian men are hairy, you know? Okay, so then uh, Asians, they do have their own standards. 
Uh, do you understand what I mean? Yeah. So you have to be uh, careful about that, actually. And normally, um, as far as I know, I'm sorry to mention it in here. Um, so because, as you know, a uh, lion is hairy as well as sheep. But there are two main differences. Well, there are other differences, but the main ones, the hair, hair of the lion will be mainly in the chest and the back. Okay, but the, uh, but the sheep is everywhere in the body, you know. That's one thing. And the second difference, um, do you know the back of the sheep is big? But with the lion, is, he doesn't have back. From the behind, just straight, you know, flat. <clears throat> okay, so it is a uh, wild sheep is uh, ignorant, but very strong. Strong and ignorant. Sorry? Sorry? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. So even they could be learned, but they will remain ignorant, you know? Do you understand? Yeah. The next is a goat. Um, how, do, how to distinguish the goat? So normally uh, the goat will have very showing neck. Not long, but showing. Okay. Uh, <laughs> um, so the, the, the first thing, it is the bright personality in terms of being very smart. Very smart personality. And it is the person, uh, if it is a man, then uh, even the, the female, they are very, uh, you can say, well off in the sexual side. They are very, so they very rarely complain about that side. Okay, so when you go to the surgery, so the... Uh, uh, the less people to complain, it could be uh, lions, tigers, as well as goats, in terms of the sexual disability. Okay, so they do have really high uh, potentiality of that cell. Um, and they have, um, uh, it's the people who like to play games, different types of games. So, for example, uh, if you want to play um, uh, uh, something, let's say that, uh, what do they call that uh, new Counter-Strike? Do you know the uh, fighting game? G call of Duty. Duty. So make sure that you are in the team of the goat, not against the team of the goat. Why? Because he's going to eat you all. Okay. Uh, and also, uh, <clears throat> it is the person who can make hole and put like a carpet on top and invite you to have a food. And he will be sitting on the ground, but when you come to sit, you fall into that hole. <laughs> so just be careful. Um, as well as, um, it's the person, a uh, very open person, open in terms of um, whatever he has inside, he will just express it, you know. For example, uh, I'm finding you... Uh, negative in some certain things. You are greedy, you are this, you are that. So, because for example, let's say that I'm lion, I will never mention it in front of
to die. Okay, and they are very good in terms of like uh, very collective. Okay, so Ant Man will be with his family, working, and so he will never disown his own people. Okay, so that's a good thing about about it, and very like uh, hard working and very brave, huge courage. Uh, so, uh, as far as I know, the animal that can lift uh, ten times m more heavier than himself, Amara, mm -hmm. is ant. Yeah. And even stronger than the tiger. And uh, tiger is stronger than lion, Amara. Tiger can lift eight times more. Irbis also eight times, Amara. And lion was four times, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Means ant is the strongest animal. Because ten times more. Can live ten times more than his weight. Would that be translated as he can take more jobs? I think so. Yeah, two, two exactly, jobs yeah. or three jobs a week. Exactly. Yeah. So within the same time, can do many things. Maybe we will have to put him in competition with you. Maybe how many jobs he can do? I think Ant will be stronger than all of us. Maybe yeah. because he can do so many things. Well, not me, but <laughs> <laughs> not me also. <laughs> yeah, I was saying, you know, for example, like him. Um, Nations, because I was speaking to you about this before, that, you know, could, could we have it there where a nation could be a certain animal and that nation would be the animal? Or, for example, ants, you get a lot living together, don't you? And yeah. you get loads of them, you can't see no, them. I, I think you are very, very right. hard working. Yeah, yeah, you are very right. Yeah. So for example, I would say like, like Chinese people, they yeah. are very, very hard working. Yeah, yeah. And Japanese, for example. Yeah, yeah, very hard working. Well, Japanese are more wise, I think. Can, they're in that uh, yeah, I agree. as well. Yeah, yeah, I agree, I agree. Uh, because uh, the thing which moves us from inside is our character, yeah. which is based on some certain animal's character, of course, yeah. So, is, so for example, let's say that uh, Russians, okay, uh, among them a lot of bears. And even, for some reason, the uh, title, uh, what do they call, logo of their nation is bear. Am yeah. I right? Yeah. yeah. So, uh, so each single uh, nation so there could be one animal which is majority of a population. I agree with this point, yes. Yeah. I agree with this point. <clears throat> so that is actually uh, all. And the, the last thing is very greedy animal. Uh, ant is very greedy animal. Okay, so uh, that is all about, inshallah, our face reading. Okay, and um, I say, uh, may Allah increase your knowledge and anyone who is following us and watching us. And then I say, uh, um, um, as uh, <coughs> Razi in the very beginning said, it is uh, principles of this knowledge is 100% reliable, but implementation may not be reliable. Okay, so for example, uh, applying the knowledge, uh, it is different to the knowledge itself. Knowledge is very reliable, but when you are applying and implementing it, maybe you can make some mistakes. Okay, yeah, so then. Uh, so Sheikh, you know, we've done the whole course now yeah. and you've given us a lot of uh, examples of the theory, yeah. you know, about tigers having wide faces yeah. or rats having tight faces. Yeah. Um, so obviously this, that's, the theory is really good, but I think we need like a practical yeah. demonstration of it. <laughs> so if you can practically demonstrate how you would face read someone based on the animal. Okay, so anyway... Um <laughs> Maybe practically we can just apply on Sunil Bay here, inshallah. So, uh, in my own understanding, he should be um, the wolf. Why do I say that? Because first of all, uh, he has strong jaws, you know. So the jaws are proper strong. Okay, and he doesn't have a circular face, tall, long face. Okay, as well as his nose is sticking out as wolves. Okay, and... Um, only my, my um, as well as, uh, for example, amongst the dog animals, dog family, wolf mainly that uh, has a uh, head on top of the forehead, am I right? Because the rest of the dog uh, animals is only forehead and then just flat, am I right? No head. Okay, so he has forehead as well as he has head also, which is more likely to be a wolf. What do you mean by head? Do you mean like the top? For example, on top of the forehead, there should be something, you know? Right. So, extra, you know, sticking out. Okay. Okay, with him, so he has that. But dog animals, mainly, they do not have a head. Only forehead, and it goes. But wolf has that, among the rest of the do dog uh, family. Okay? Uh, as well as, um, for example, uh, 
uh, very uh, proportional and a bit uh, wider uh, 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 shoulders and wide chest. So build. Yeah. Okay. So naturally. Okay. Naturally is there. So it is like strong animal. Okay. Yeah. As well as. Uh, for example, lo legs and uh, uh, hands are not taller than the rest of the body. It's very balanced. Okay? As well as wolf has a neck. So he has a neck. Okay? So only if someone can oppose me, he can oppose me in terms of two things. One is, wolf will normally have eyes sticking out and his eyes are in. As well as, wolf doesn't have fleshy fa face. So he may have a bit fleshy. So I say, it's the, his origin. According to his origin, his eye is not in. Okay, so maybe in Uzbekistan that eye would be in, but the place from where he is, it's not in. It's proper, like uh, good. As well as same thing about his face. Okay, for, so maybe in England his uh, face is f flashy. There is flash. Okay, but in uh, his uh, place from where he is originally, so it's not uh, that uh, uh, flashy face. Am I right? is less than average actually, which is wolf, normally. So in my own understanding, he's a wolf. Allah Allah. Okay, and anyway, the last thing I say is my offer. So the first three people who find what my animal is, I'm going to give them some gift. It will be a good gift. It will be some book, okay, um, English, uh, some Islamic book. Inshallah with some certain signatures, etc. Okay, so the first three people who find what my animal is. So the challenge is on? It's challenge is there, yeah. Okay. No, just to see that uh, uh, brothers and sisters, they are following and they are learning also, not only just listening as a, like a drama or like a Sami Yusuf. Uh, and I should. <clears throat>